Hello YouTube and welcome back. This is video 5 in my series on utilizing Blender as a video editor. Today I'm going to talk about improving performance of your video preview window. Now, on my computer I don't really have an issue with my previews because I'm only dealing with 720p video source. But if I was dealing with a higher resolution, or if I was on a laptop or a lower end system, I would actually have a problem playing back the video in the preview window when I scrub over or when I hit play. Now, that's going to be a problem when you're really trying to see exactly what the output is going to look like in your preview. So, what you can do to actually remedy this problem is you can set up a video proxy. And what we're going to do is we're going to set up four different video proxies by selecting our video with our right mouse button. And on the right side in the properties window, you're going to see a option for proxy time code. You want to put a check mark there. And there are four options, 25%, 50%, 75%, and 100%. Now this video that is by default showing up here is 100% of the quality of the source. You can set up proxies that will generate a version that is 25% of the quality of the, of the original source, 50%, 75 and 100%, just by clicking each of these. And then what we do is we go over to strip and we rebuild proxy in timecode indices. So I'm going to do that. Now what it's doing right now is it's actually making four versions of the video so that I can actually bring up a lower quality version in the preview that is easier for my computer to render in real time. So let's give that a second. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to view each of those proxies or the lower quality versions. We're going to select the actual proxies by going up to the preview window and clicking on this box here. And we're going to, or sorry, we're going to actually click on properties under view. On the right side, we have proxy rend. And we're going to click this. And you can select a proxy size of 25, 50, 75, or 100. And you just, I'll put it to 25% and you'll see the quality change. If you just look over there, you'll see that the quality should change. It went to a lower resolution. And we'll go to 50, a little bit better, 75, a little bit better, and 100. So if I set this to 25, it will still render the full resolution of this video when I output it. But when I'm actually doing the preview, it will use the lower quality video so that it doesn't bog down my hardware, uh, my system. So it will run much better. And that's how you set up a proxy.